How's it going everyone? My name is Forever Fen, and welcome back to Devil May Cry 5. We are on mission 12. Don't read that. Don't don't care about that mission 11 reason thing. That's the level we just did. But we're on mission 12 called Yamato. And we just got, in the last episode, a weapon called the Cavalier, which is a... looks like a motorcycle. And <laughs> it looks fun. Anyway... Um... I don't really have anything to say. Because in the last level, we saved... Yeah, Mission 11, reason. Uh, we saved, uh... Trish. She was inside the knight that was riding the time horse back in Mission... Was it 5? Yeah, I think it was Mission 5. Yeah, Mission 5, the, the Devil Sword Sparta. She was inside the night, the... I call Cavalier Angelo. So, that was cool. And we caught up with V. Or V caught up with us. And then we just kind of left him with our new motorcycle. And told him to take care of Trish. He told Trish, Let me tell you the story of my birth. And then it cut. So, we still don't know anything about V. Um, now I'm confused because I thought V was Virgil. I, now I think Urizen's Virgil with all the stuff that's happening with Dante. I don't know what's going on. Though I don't think I actually mentioned it, but in Devil May Cry 3, you fight Virgil as Dante, and Virgil gets stuck in the demon world, and then he goes all Darth Vader because he gets possessed by the... Well, not possessed. Basically taken control of by the King of Hell at the time, Mundus, and becomes Nello Angelo, and then you fight Nello Angelo in Devil May Cry 1, and Nello Angelo, after you beat him, you realize it was your brother Virgil and you killed him, so it's kind of weird if Virgil's back now, but I don't think I ever mentioned that Virgil was technically supposed to be dead, so I figured that'd be a good thing to bring up. Anyway, enough talking. After awakening from a month spent recuperating, Dante headed for the Demon King. He crushed the Demon Knight blocking his path and rescued Trish from within, only to continue making his way towards the Quiloth tree. Because I said it right this time. Meanwhile, V revealed his past to Trish. Are we going to see that in the cutscene right now? Hopefully. The 1st of May, a few weeks ago, at 9.19pm. Suffering defeat after defeat, that man's body was reaching its limit breaking down but he couldn't die yet the man had a job that must be done to defeat his twin brother it is fucking virgil oh my god <sighs> he's not doing good Dante. oh it's the same voice actor From devil with the strength of the Yamato. And eventually, the man became a true devil. Oh. Fifteenth of June, eleven forty-seven a.m. I've tried to hold together my crumbling flesh with what little demonic power I have left, but I'm approaching my limit. In separating and regaining my human soul, I've realized the gravity of the crime I've committed. I've realized how important everything was, everything I've thrown away in my pursuit of power. Is that why you went to find Dante? Yes. Foolish. 
I thought that maybe he could change my... Maybe fix. Maybe right my wrong. Tell me. Was this fool before you, right? I'm not your mommy, B. <laughs> You're a big boy. And you need to see this through. Fucking Trish and Dante's her magic war. power. Dante's war, huh? Oh, look at it. It's so cool. Oh. I want to use it. I want to use it. I want to use it. That for Road Rash. <laughs> oh, oh, those are the best things about the Devil May Cry games are the videos after Dante gets a new weapon. Because oh, I just get to see him use it. I heard that's one of his special abilities, is as soon as he gets something new, he knows exactly how to use it. Holy crap. A lot just happened. So wait. I was right technically. On both accounts, V is Virgil, and Urizen is Virgil. So, I guess it makes sense. Yamato was the devil sword that was able to cut anything in two. So, Virgil used it to cut his soul in half, in two? And so the pure demon side became Urizen, and the human side became V. But he said he still has some demonic power left, so maybe he's more half-devil, half-demon. So, then, Yurizen, who... Okay, if V can't keep his body together and is dying, maybe the same's happening to Yurizen. And that's why he needed to get the, the Quilof tree, and the fruit, and the blood. And he's like... Because he, you notice that the blood was just pumping into him when we fought him. It's like life support. And it's keeping him alive. Maybe. And now V's like, got, has a, he's having a conscience, because Virgil before is just, I want more power, always. And he's pissed that Dante's stronger than him, because Dante's a badass. Okay, it's making sense. It's making sense. Okay. And now V wants to help Dante. Let's see what we can buy for the Cavalier. Okay. Cross line, cross. Oh, that looks sick. Cross over your twin cavalier for a devastating slam attack. Activates gear wheel. On the ground, press R, L, and forward triangle. Okay. So you might have noticed that I have a lot more red orbs than I did at the end of the last video. I went back and started messing around with Dante in the other levels. I haven't used cavalier yet, so I don't know. How, like, I forced myself to not use it so we i don't know how it works yet i've just been playing around with the um the sparta and the balrog i got a lot better with both especially the balrog jesus christ that's good so i'm gonna learn cross lane slipstream ride oh that's the thing he just did oh that's cool Ride your momentum forward and cross over your twin cavalier for a devastating slam attack. Activates gear wheel. Can chain into combo A or combo B's second step? R1 back to forward. That's too cool to not use. Slipstream 2. I want it. Give me a full up one. High side. Um, in mid air. Back triangle. This high velocity attack ramps you skyward after the enemy you hit. Okay. Breaking. Drag airborne enemies into the spinning wait, uh, let me see it. Oh, it's like a sli it's like the helmbreaker. Okay. Dive into a backbreaking ground impact. 
Well, I'll get that one. That's pretty good. Idling? On the ground, R1 back, triangle, triangle, triangle. Okay. Send enemies flying with blows from your twin cavalier. That's 35,000. This is getting expensive. But I almost have everything. I just need high side and idling. What else do I have? I got everything for Ebony and Ivory. I need the last thing for Coyote A. But so far, I'm not really enjoying Coyote A. I don't really use it. Clean and though, is amazing. I can get Royal Guard style level 3 as well. Oh, I can get Enemy Step. Learn that. I should probably earn, learn to get more orbs as well, because that will just help me out in the long run, but at the same time, I want fun stuff right now. I want to get Ignition 4 for sure. Cavalier. Let's get... Idling as well. Okay. Then I will buy the get more orbs. That sounds like it's a smart thing to do. I wonder what the X provocation things are. Special taunt given only to those who paid a heavy price. It could increase the stylish rank more than a normal taunt. I wonder what that's like. L3 and that. Okay. Well, I am out of orbs again. So, this. I just pretty much purchased whatchamacallit stuff, uh, Cavalier stuff. Alright, let's continue on with our Dante adventure, Mission 12. Oh, I'm excited to see what happens next. What's the next weapon we're gonna get? Because we've only gotten one new one so far. I mean, Balrog's technically new, but we started with that. I guess Sparta, but... I don't know, but I want other things. What else does Dante get? He's got to have more than just these three. Unless you want to die. Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Um. Jesus Christ. He just summons it out of nowhere? Ah, oh, I can't do any moves with it. Do I need actually need somebody to combo? <laughs> it's weird that not to see him with a weapon at all. That's oh, so sick. Did I miss anything? In Devil May Cry 3, he steals um, Lady's motorcycle and rides it up the side of a wall and uses it as a melee weapon. And there was always... What? What the fuck? Hey, stop that. There's always the joke of, when do we get the motorcycle weapon? Well, looks like we got it. That's it. Shit, hi. No, come back. Oh, you're stuck in here with me. Anybody else? like lights on lightning. It's like the frickin' Nevin. I'm guessing you're dead. Oh, 
Oh, I love Dante. Favorite character. By far. Oh, I feel such a badass when I play him. I don't feel nearly as badass playing as Nero or V. Oh, Dante, my boy, where have you been all my life? Okay. Um, now where? That's a pretty looking area, actually. Wait. There's no secrets, right? Like, secret mission stuff? Doesn't look like it. Okay, cool. Making sure. Because I need more orbs, damn it. Oh, wait. Is this a statue of Sparta? It looks like Sparta's thing. Oh, wow. This is like an old school Devil May Cry puzzle. You need some blood, huh? Sorry. You wouldn't like mine. <laughs> I love Dante. Alright. So, we need to sacrifice some blood? And I don't know if it's that half demon blood itself will work. Or. Oh, I have enemy step now. That means I can jump off enemies. It's like such a good thing to use um, to keep your combos going. It was so broken. Huh. Dried blood in the gutter here. Guess that explains how the pools down there get filled. Oh, hi. These things are gross. Does that make the blood flow? I don't know. I'm kind of confused with that. Um, wait. There's one and two. There's a second one up there. What's behind you? Okay, then what's behind you? Oh, I don't know which one to use. Uh, I'll take the upper one. That looks more interesting. Maybe I'll have to come back and play this level again for an alternate pathway. Gotten here, boys and girls. Nothing. Ah, something. I chose the right one. Oh. Ow! Dang it. Wrong button. Let's try the Cavalier again. This thing is so overpowered! This is just my favorite. Wait. Is he wearing goggles? <laughs> That's how you... He wears goggles for the motorcycle. That's funny. Does he put them on at all? How does he look like in Double Trigger with them? <laughs> he puts them on? I love it! Oh, that's so cool. Oh, I love it. I will take this purple orb fragment, thank you very much. Ah, yeah. So good. Oh. Um. Sounds like a lot of blood. 
It's like beating hard. Um, nothing there. Oh. It's weird to see trees. Alright, what are we fighting in here? Flash? Oh! <laughs> gotcha. It looks like the Onanuki from Monster Hunter. Breakneck Predator. Fury. See if you're faster than this. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yes. Was that it? <laughs> <laughs> I think I just got really lucky with the counters on that. Because <laughs> that was a little too easy, in my opinion. I bet he's like a bitch. It's probably like the frickin' blitz enemies from 4, just for this game. Oh, great. Crossroads. Decisions, decisions. <laughs> well, Snake always says go left. Ooh, but I see a blue orb that way. Oh, hi. Thank you for not beating me up. Oh, um, for Gunslinger, I don't use it very much, but I got this move for it. Oh, wait. I got Honeycomb. Um, with, uh, this one, the Coyote A, I got, like, I got cool stuff like that, and with Kalina and I think I got... Multi rockets. Oh, wait. That doesn't look fun. I'm going for the blue orb. Sword Master. I love the. Okay, I'm sorry about that. Oh, I can't go this way? No! I thought I can fit! I was feeling so proud of myself. Right through. Ugh. I need to learn that one. I need to figure out all these new combos that I got with it. Why did you sit there and say there was a crossroads if I can't go anywhere else? Oh, wait. Can I go somewhere else? Where did I come from? Oh, hi. I did not realize. Ooh. Okay, let's, uh... See where this goes. If I follow these grooves... When in doubt, smack it. Family motto. That's the family motto, huh? Ah, oh, it's all over me. Ugh. I don't even know why that got me. Just the way it came out. Ugh. I like tasted it. Okay. Yep. Here comes the blood. Yeah, I'm drenched in it now. Oh, I just went back in a circle. Okay. That's cool. 
down with that. How did I miss that? Alright. So there. So there's nothing else in here. No secrets. Alright, so two of them are filled. I need to fill up two more. So I need to fill up this one and... I don't even know where the other one would be. Oh well, we'll figure that out as time goes on. So it can't go that way. I was way. hoping I could just follow the groove, but they're not making it easy for me. Oh, duh, Eric. Follow the groove. Forever Fen strikes again. Hi. Let's go! Oh, I'm doing donuts! And I can just keep going, it seems. You're not dead yet. Oh, there's multiples of you. Ow! Alright, let's get some crowd control going on. Okay, the frickin' Cavalier is so broken! I can't believe how broken it is! Why do you want to use any- I mean, it's very slow, don't get me wrong. Ridiculously slow. Um, I came from that way. I need to use Devil Trigger a lot more, I'm realizing. I kind of, like, don't use it, but I get it back so quickly in this game. Like, super quickly. In the other games, it took forever to get your Devil Trigger back sometimes. I'm gonna stand right here. Oh, I still got covered in blood. I really like that they're, it's kind of giving us a little bit of a, like, old school Devil May Cry puzzle here. Because, I mean, Devil May Cry started as a Resident Evil thing, like, they were making Resident Evil- I want to keep Mr. Demon King waiting. Gotta pick up the pace. They were literally making a Devil May Cry, or Resident Evil game, and they realized that when you fired your guns, on an enemy, it would juggle them in the air, and they're like, oh, that's not good for Resident Evil, so let's do something else with it. So, they took the idea and made Devil May Cry, and that's when, where Dante's original name was, it was Tony Redgrave. Huh, okay, I think I found another blood thing there. It was Tony Redgrave. But then they decided to change him to Dante, because I guess Tony Redgrave doesn't sound as cool as Dante. But, um, that's why the pistols say t for Tony Redgrave on him. Three, Pretty cool stuff. Whoa, hi. Oh, frick. I need to take care of you first, because... Frickin' spiky shit that you do like that. Ow! 
Oh, you're dead already? Get down. Fuck, I almost had it. Okay, doing good. Yeah, so that's how Devil May Cry started. I'm pretty sure. I remember reading about it. I'm there might be a small few details off in that story, I can't remember for sure, it's been a long time since I did that. But yeah, it did start off originally as Resident Evil. I think the Tony Redgrave stuff I might not remember completely. Okay. Another gold orb, I refuse to use those, as always. I'd rather just take the loss. Um, got that one. Alright. So it looks like we just need another Kreloff thing. The blood gross thing. Did I avoid the blood that time? I think I did. Okay, cool. I don't know about you, I don't like being covered in blood. Not how I like to spend my... What's today? Wednesday evenings. Saturdays are okay, though. I like that it actually has, like, a fresh look to it, while the other two that I did look a lot older. That looks like it's big enough for me to go down now. I didn't need to do all four? Whew. That should be all of them. I'm gonna take that. It's been a while since I used my brain this much. I love you, Dante. Even I was just saying that, like, oh, I'm glad they actually threw a puzzle in here for once. Uh, this way. No, wait. Wait, where is the thing? There it is. I knew it was somewhere. Is there a blue orb fragment down that hallway? I saw something blue, I think. Might have just been a torch. So what happens if I would have went this way first? Oh, come on, just you guys? Oh, I missed. Damn it, I need the fire. Ignition on. I just love the real impact. Just fucking show real again. Love it. Love it. Love Dante. Gosh, I wish there were more people like Dante in the world. The world would be way more badass, guarantee you that. So what is over this way? Whoa, hi. What's, uh... What you doing? I'm here now. Oh, 
What she did was just delay the inevitable. Oh, there's another one. Look at you. Okay. Oh, anything else here? No? Alright. Ooh, that was close. There we go. Okay, close up, that shotgun can one shot those things, that's good to know. Uh, double trigger stuff. Something that way. Oh, wait, am I back the way we originally came from? Wait, where is this? Blood? Yeah. Oh, okay. Cool. Sounds good to me. Alright, let's uh, head downward. Oh, I missed. Oh, okay. Oh, this ain't creepy. Ah! Can't see. Oh, okay. This brings me back. Why does this bring you back? Oh, is this a secret mission? Wait, hold on. Where do I need to stand? Aha! Stay in the air for more than 15 seconds? Just have to stay in the air for more than 15 seconds? With enemy step, trickster, and cavalier. Oh my god, this is so frickin' bullshit. <laughs> Easiest blue orb fragment ever. I thought it was gonna be like the one from Devil May Cry 3 where you're, I'm like running on walls and air tricking and enemy stepping everywhere. Like, that was ridiculous. I remember in, uh, if you're playing it as Virgil, he actually had to, like, utilize his teleport up like crazy, his, um... Was it called Air Trick? I don't think his was called Air Trick. I don't know. You got a health up, though. This is some good music. Ah, physics. Wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna push you. And now I feel complete. Let's continue on. I feel like that was like a freebie. It's on the frickin' main path and everything. So why does this take Dante back? Where are we going? Get all those? Okay, cool. Like, where are- the, the tree has destroyed so much that I can't even see where this- Oh, hi. Like, it makes zero sense to me. Oh, wait, isn't this the- Dante's house? We saw this in the cutscene with Virgil, right? Is this Dante's house? Holy shit. 
can't believe any of this is still standing. Like, look at that. Look at the city. It is completely destroyed. Look at that. Holy crap. Holy shit. Is that the tree? Oh my god. I'm like... Wow. That fucks me up for a second. I did not expect it to be, like, that big. Oh my god. Like, I just, like, moved up and I'm just like, oh. 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 So, yep. Is, this is where... Virgil split himself. Is this where Dante hid the closet? Is this like the DMC reboot? We have to explore Dante's house now? So many questions! I just need to wait and I'll get answered. I'm just excited. Ah, there you are. Hi, Griffin. Flock off, better face. Hey, what's wrong with you? Hey! Hey, Dante! The demonic power was activated in me once. When Virgil lovingly jammed this through my chest. Double May Cry 3. I always wondered. Why did my father give me the rebellion? Okay. What are you muttering? <laughs> Over the years, I've been stabbed and jabbed by a number of things. But who would have ever guessed? Have you lost your mind? There's a demon to destroy! Kill yourself later! I'll help! If the Yamato can separate man from devil, then what about the rebellion? Wow! You are absorbing the Sparta! Legendary Devil Sword, Devil Sword Dante. Dante. New Legendary Devil Sword, Devil Sword Dante. A blade born when Dante absorbed the rebellion into his body. The weapon shares both his name and his will. What the fuck? Oh my god, so much just happened! Explanation. Let's do this. A tutorial, Devil Sword Dante. The basic abilities of Rebellion and Devil Sword Sparta carry over to this blade. And pressing Circle and Swordmaster style conjures swords that attack anonymously? Use the blades in tandem for a relentless wave of hack and slash carnage. He's like Virgil, because Virgil was able to summon swords too. But now Dante can do them? Um, activating Devil Trigger with this equipped will conjure swords that provide different types of support depending on your style. These include higher mobility, simultaneous attacks, auto uh, automatic counters, or strong defense. Stronger defense. Okay. Gunslinger. Sorry. Gunslinger on the top left. Um, Royal Guard, Trickster, and then Swordmaster, it looks like. Oh, and we're about to just fuck up Yurizen? Oh shit, we are! Well, 
Oh. Sin Devil Trigger? Hold L1 to change from the DT gauge to the STD gauge. Did it have to be STD? There is a new gauge above the DT gauge, the Sin Devil Trigger gauge, to fill the- I'm gonna call it Sin Devil Trigger, because it's just weird to call it an STD. <laughs> he got- he got an STD from his rebellion. Sorry. <laughs> Bad joke. To fill this gauge, transfer power from the DDK, DT gauge by holding down L1. I need- so I need to transfer my- I was just talking about how easy it is to get Devil Trigger, so I need to transfer it into my Sin Gauge. Charge STD Gauge to max, and then hold L1. Hold L1 with a full STD Gauge to activate Sin Devil Trigger, you gain insane attack power. But Vitality does not recover and you can't deactivate this form manually. Oh my god, it's so cool! I'm trying to charge it. <laughs> okay. How do oh. I think it's full? I think it's full. Give it to me. Oh. <laughs> Barrier. Ow. Okay, we're doing it. As long as you live, you will not understand. Okay, I need to start paying better attention here. Ow. I need to pay attention where those tentacles are coming from. Ow! I'm trying! I'm trying! It's over! Holy fuck! I almost died, but I have no idea how to use this. I don't. All this time, and you still don't get it. It is you who does not understand. 15th of June, 12 p.m. It has begun. Like, I really like Miko, she's pretty cool. Trish, you should just carry V. Was the Yamato the entire time? This inconvenience. 
matters not. Travel through the blood. Holy fuck! I didn't do the good, did I? Hey! I actually have a score lower than an A, and I'm very proud of myself for that. Holy fuck! That was amazing! Oh. Drawn out devil, combo damage, sandbagged, all style change, shift into top gear. Fiendish friendly fire, parry prince, sinful. Oh my gosh, I don't even know where to begin with that. Devil Sword Dante? <laughs> okay, so. Are people texting me? No. Sorry, thought I got a text. Anyway. Oh, gosh. So, in Devil May Cry 3 is the earliest, like, that's the prequel game. And Dante was given the rebellion. And in it, like, we find out that, like, when you get... When Virgil and Dante get stabbed with their swords, the Yamato for Virgil and the Rebellion for Dante, it awaken their devil blood and let them start doing their devil triggers, which you, you've seen me do before. And But, like, the description of the Rebellion is constantly, like, in Devil May Cry 3, is a sword that hasn't realized its full potential yet. And so, Sparta frickin' used the Yamato to seal off Hellgates and Hell, and then he gave it to Virgil, so it split Virgil in half and... The Rebellion this entire time has been able to merge things together. So, Dante used the power of the Rebellion, merged the Sparta Sword with himself, with the Rebellion, made a brand new sword called the Dante, which is incredible because that's what Sparta did. Sparta had the Sparta Sword. Named after him, and now Dante has a sword named after him. And it gave him the Sin Devil Trigger. It reminded me of Devil May Cry 2. You had a Majin Devil Trigger that was like your invincibility, you're about to die, so just destroy everything. But this one seems way different because I wasn't invincible, that's for sure. I got really close to dying. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. So is it gonna be that that's how we get how uh, Virgil? Like, is Dante going to fuse V and Urizen back together? Because he has that power, or is, does he not have that power anymore that he just used it, the Rebellion all up? Oh my god! Oh, that's so cool. And then Urizen said the tree is ready. Oh, man. Mission 13, three warriors. Hold on, let's see what we got to look forward to in the next episode. Mode for veterans, Nero, Dante, or V. All three co-op? Multi? Oh, this is going to be great. Oh, I'm so excited. I need to go calm down. That was incredible amazing. Holy crap. I'll catch you all in the next one. Later.